What is up, you guys? It is your boy, John, here from Pumo Plow. Welcome back to another Rattlesnake Valley here on the PC. I do appreciate you guys clicking on the video. How's it going? And welcome. Welcome, guys. So first things first on this video, guys, we are going to be working up here at the pigs for a little bit anyway. For a couple minutes anyway. So let's do that. Uh, need to clean them up a little bit. Actually, they weren't bad. It was like it wasn't, you know, great. But it also wasn't bad, so there's that. All right, so what else do we need to do with the pigs? We need to... Uh, we need to do, though... Jeez, oh, there's stumps there. I forgot about the stumps still being there. Oh, goodness. Somebody should clean those up, huh? <laughs> Somebody named John should clean those up, huh? Okay. Uh, we need to fill up our feed mixer. Is what we need to do so let's do that let's get some more corn or wheat whatever we have up here still I believe it's corn if I'm not mistaken we're out of wheat up here but I could be wrong so I did end up selling a bunch of that back yeah we're out of wheat okay so let's get some corn we should probably look at planting corn eventually uh, we are putting pig food in storage by the way which I don't think it shows on here yeah, I know, it doesn't show it on this map. So, we have been putting some pig food in storage. So, I think we're doing pretty good on our pig food. But, we don't want to run out, do we, children? No. So, children, uh, adults, y'all, hi. Um, <laughs> we definitely don't want to run out or, or have a shortage of corn. So, we should probably look at doing that again before... Uh, honestly, before too much longer, so we will have to look into that before too much longer. But for now, we're good. We're good. We can actually use potatoes and canola here as well. Or sugar beet, not potato. We did not do uh, sugar beet or potato. Oh my god. We did not do <laughs> potatoes up here. We did sugar beet because it's so much easier. So much easier, although with course play, it really doesn't matter which one we would have gone with, to be perfectly honest, so really does not matter. All right, so all of that straw, by the way, that we picked up down on, uh, down on 13, all of that straw has been brought up here now. So we have a considerable amount, definitely a considerable amount of straw up here and uh, we should be good honestly most likely for the life of the map on straw uh, I'll have to give you guys a number here in just a second but it's like a lot it's a lot so it took forever to haul it all up here I what I ended up doing I was having problems with the truck slash honestly I mean 47,000 liters at a time that's not a lot so what I was actually doing was using the tractor with all four tippers Holland straw. That was yeah, something. Uh, it wasn't the most uh, speedy proposition, but uh, yeah, so we're good on straw. <laughs> we're good on straw. Uh, we didn't have a lot of speed getting in here, but you know what? It worked. And it worked quite well, actually. So that's all that really matters, you know? I mean, I, there was a point where I just like literally got up and walked away from the map and just let it run. <laughs> It's like, I'm going to go eat dinner. I'll be back, map. Thanks. And just let it let it run. And, and it did just fine. So that is the beauty part of course play, by the way. Course play. I got made fun of for the way I say horse play. It's course. Not horse. Anyway. Um, I, I, I do enjoy it quite a bit, being able just to kind of go, okay, I'm going to walk away from the map for five minutes and... It's going to uh, continue to run stuff, you know? Like, gotta love it, right? Gotta love it. Manure is not much here. I have been putting that in my storage over here as well. Uh, someday, maybe we'll do something with it. I don't know, honestly, if we'll ever actually, like, fertilize with it or, or whatever. I don't know. I really can't answer that right now because I don't know... If we'll do that. I could see maybe doing something with course play. 
far as like, you know, have him run and then he'd come back here and fill up and then go out in the field and run. That'd be kind of cool, right? I don't know. It's going to take a lot of manure to do anything with any of these fields on this map because they're all big fields. And like I have uh, talked about in the past, I don't plan on getting cows on this map. So this is going to be sheep and pig farm is what I can kind of see doing here. So there is that. Okay. Canola. So I don't know where it's going to fit into the schedule because I'm actually kind of really far ahead on this series and the Goldcrest series, which is really good uh, for several reasons. But uh, I got a 24-hour stream coming up, and usually the week after the 24-hour stream, I'm kind of just wiped out almost all week. Um, the other thing is with the pumpkin day coming up down at our farm, I know I'm going to lose time there. And... Uh, Christmas lights are knocking on the door, honestly. So it's like, ooh. So basically, uh, yeah, I'm going to get as far ahead as possible on this series and the Goldcrest series. And then actually, I talked about in one of these past videos, doing a Let's Play on the Plain and Simple Map by Stevie. And that is definitely going to be a thing. I don't know how soon I'm going to release uh, the next episode or what day that's going to fit in. It's probably already out by the time this video comes out. I'm not totally sure because I haven't uploaded one as of recording this. Just episode, quote, zero, as I like to do. Uh, episode, as of recording this, episode, quote, one and two, which is really it's two and three. But one and two, because zero was zero. Uh, episode one and two are actually recorded, and I have not edited or voiced them yet, but they are recorded. As you guys see, we are putting some pig food in storage, which is fantastic that we're able to do that every time we fast time. So as long as we stay ahead of it a little bit, I don't know how many pigs we have. 542. I'd like to get around a thousand maybe. And then every fast time sell off a few, you know, to get us back down to the thousand mark or so is what I would like to do. But we'll see how, uh, how efficient we are at that, right? All right, let's go ahead and dump that. Uh, but yeah, the Plain and Simple map by Stevie, it's awesome. I, I really actually am enjoying that map quite a bit. Uh, like I said, I've recorded two other episodes, and uh, it, it's a lot of fun. But I, I'm not sure as of right this moment where it's going to fit into the schedule or anything like that. I don't want to trim back the four videos I'm doing in the Let's Plays already. You know, two here and two in Goldcrest. I don't want to trim that back any to, like, open up a day, you know? So it might be a Saturday series. It might be a Sunday series. I don't know. I don't know yet. So there is that. Okay, so the only other thing we need to do for the pigs is uh, water. Because the cleanliness hasn't come through yet and the corn's good. So water. They could use some water. That's in here. Should have cut that tree down on the corner here too, huh? We can still do that. <laughs> and in fact, we might do that eventually. Not sure when, but we will do that eventually. Uh, by the way, our wool prices, I know we had moved our wool down yonder a while back. It is still bad. It's in the red, and it's not going up or down. So I don't really know if I should sell it or if I should hold it. I'm probably going to hold it until I need the trailer back at the... Uh, what are they called? The sheep? Which honestly could be a while. So I don't need that truck necessarily. I don't need that trailer for a while. So I might just leave it down there. Uh, it's kind of just chilling at the spinnery, just waiting to be sold. So there's that. <laughs> but yeah, I don't I don't know about that. I'll just leave it down there for now, I guess. I'm not, uh, I'm not too overly concerned about it, honestly. So... There's that. I would like to get a field, though, guys, very soon. I, I, I'm starting to realize a mistake in how I play Farm Sim a little bit, which might sound a little silly, but I'm realizing that I get into animals way too soon. Because, you know, as a, a, a guy that's making lots of plays for you guys to watch, I feel like I don't want to just harvest all the time and harvest all the time and harvest all the time. However, that is the game. You know, that is part of the game. But what I do is I get into animals and then I'm like, 
oh, well, I don't have any money to buy all the equipment I need, or I don't have money to continue to grow the farm while trying to get into animals. Or, like with the pigs, didn't really have enough money to get into pigs like I wanted to. Same thing with sheep, honestly. Um, so we're sitting here at the spinnery. Uh, by the way, our animals are pretty good. They could use a little, little grass over at the sheep, but that's about it. Um, it's 19 or 9,000. So I think we're just going to hold it, hold off on it for right now. Um, so back here at the, the field, field 13 here, this is the field I bailed, of course, or not bailed, picked up loose. Uh, I was actually running the little tractor. Don't ask me why running the little tractor with all four tippers and it worked quite well. Just saying it actually did work quite well. 13 uh, to the train, please. And go to the first waypoint and go. So, yeah, I'm having some issues with course play where it's like nothing wants to work. And then all of a sudden, if I just, it, all I have to do, honestly, is reset my game. And everything will start working just fine. Until I reset, it's like, no. Not going to do it, you see. So, it's kind of strange, honestly. But, there's nothing, not nothing, nothing I can really do about it, so. I don't know. Okay, set you on the same, actually it's canola. Uh, let's go ahead and do it. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I really feel like this has um, really, really helped my, my problem here with uh, everything on this map. Uh, okay, let's actually, let's get these combines rolling and then we'll get back to the train here in just one second because there's something going on with the train, obviously. We have stuff we need to sell. So let's get the combines going because it is canola yet again, uh, I believe in all of our fields. This will probably be our last canola harvest that we do. It's probably plant corn somewhere and maybe here in 13. You know what? Let's do that. Let's plant corn in 13 if I remember to do that. Of course, there is that issue. I have to remember to do it. Um, but as long as I remember to do it, it shouldn't be a big deal. And then we'll plant something else in the other, over in the other fields. So there's that. Or we just do corn everywhere and go crazy on it. You know what? That's not a bad idea either. Honestly, I like planting corn. I like growing corn quite a bit, actually. Reminds me of uh, where I live. It's a lot of corn. Corn and soybeans around here. And lots of it. Lots of it. What cultivator do we have, though? Do we even have one? Because I kind of feel like I sold it. Might be in the homestead. Let's check our garage. Because I don't remember if we even have... We have the corn planter still. So if we have that, we should have a cultivator of some kind, right? Um, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We had the little 7 meter. That's right. <laughs> Oh, how could I forget about the seven meter? Yeah. Yeah, there's that. Okay. Um, I want to get to the train, but I also want to get to the sheep here real fast. Let me just pop in here. And I believe I have some uh, grass still in the big L. Got a little bit anyway. So let's go ahead and feed that out. Look at all the little sheep lined up eating. Go ahead and feed what we have. We'll see where we're at then. We're not bad. That's that's like days worth, honestly. So I'm not worried about that. Okay, pull you back in for now, Big L. But you know what I'm saying about like I feel like I'm not doing the animals the way that I quote should be. Like I should have a lot more of whatever animal name the animal all right so here's our seven hundred and twenty thousand liters of uh wheat and i don't actually know how what's our wheat price at at the train at the train oh uh, that's soybeans hang on Ooh. <laughs> it's not great man i wish i had soybeans that's a great price for, great price for soy um it's not great but you know what we just we have to it's hard to store this much grain on this map honestly so i mean it's not because i have my buildings i realize that but it is at the same time because your homestead doesn't hold anything 
relatively. And then your uh, train buildings only hold 500, so you get you, you run out of uh, run out of storage space real fast on this map. It seems like to me, so uh, that's okay. Especially for a forex map, you think they would have bumped up the homestead storage to like at least five million. I mean, I could conceivably see having. I could very easily see having five million of whatever crop. You know, if you do a couple fields, you're at five mil real fast on this map. So there's that. There is definitely that. Ah, I keep hitting my microphone, guys. I'm sorry. My apologies. <laughs> it's my first video I've ever made. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, YouTube. My apologies. <laughs> not my first video it's like my what am I about what am I up to we just had this discussion on twitch the other day by the way twitch.tv slash link is in the description come check me out live a couple days a week it's awesome it's a good time like four days a week right now maybe more I always want to do more always want to do more streaming so we'll have to wait and see how that works out but um um we had this discussion the other day. It's over 3,000 videos, like 30, like 3,000, uh, I want to say 500 or 3,600, somewhere in there. That's how many videos I have total now over on the, or right here. Never mind, not over on, uh, on YouTube. It's, it's a lot, so, yeah. And, nope, stop, last car. We're going to break that two mil? Maybe. I hope so. Two mil would be nice. We might be able to go purchase a field. I kind of... Oh, yeah, we didn't make it at all, did we? Okay. 1.988 mil. Not too bad. I don't know if there's any wheat left in this train storage, but realistically, our price is probably... Yeah. Our price is bad, 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 bad. No. Um, so let's go look. I always forget because... I don't look at fields very often. Uh, let's change this map out because that's kind of horrendous. Um, so if we were going to purchase a field, I feel like we need to get something that's already by something we already own. So I'm not going to go like up here to 31, let's say. Uh, these, let's just go for look for funsies. 16 is probably, yeah, 4.1 million. Holy jumping. I could go for a 17. It's nice and like square rectangle. That's 1.2 mil. That actually wouldn't be bad. That actually wouldn't be bad at all. And that's that's. It's right next door to a field I already have. It's square. Course play would work good. Let's go check 14 just for fun. It's going to be more than we have as well. It's 3.5. Wow, fields are expensive. They're big is the problem. So. Let's go ahead and get 17. It's 14.82 hectares, 1.2 mil, and some change. Oh, we can pick up... I forgot about missions. I never do missions. And actually, mission, mission with course play. We might have to do that. <laughs> now that I'm like getting better and more comfortable with course play. We might have to start doing some of that again on this map. Let's go ahead and buy the field. 1.2 mil dollars. And we have... What is this? Sugar beet in the field? Uh, yelp. Ooh, I don't know if I like that. <laughs> uh, you know what we could do? Because, oh, this is the wrong tractor. What am I doing? I don't need this tractor. I need the Homer Terra next door here. No. Don't want to get in your tractor. I'm getting the Homer Terra. Uh, but we could do this go around and it's instead of saving saving the sugar beets instead of saving them for the pigs because we really don't need any more for the pigs like ever is the hope because if you look what do we have in storage still we have two million we have over two million so Honestly, I'm going to say we're good there, but what we could do is sell them this time. How much? They're not worth anything, realistically, but it's a volume game, you know? We're going to get a fair bit off that field. I'm 
just going to drive through the crop, I know. Uh, I know it's not the biggest field ever down there at 17, but that's still pretty good size. That's probably roughly the same size as 12. Honestly, that's not far off from this field we're in right now. A little bit, a little bit uh, less, but not bad. So we'll have to do new courses, guys, eventually. All that kind of good stuff. You guys know how much we love recording courses, right? <laughs> uh, we'll need new courses to empty our trucks. Uh, would be the biggest thing. So, or our tractors, whatever you want to call them. So, there is that. But that should be a good time to get, you know, doing some sugar beets again. Uh, I could just go down there and, like, cultivate them under or whatever, you know, but that's okay. It's more fun. It's more fun. It's, it's, it's going to be a good time. It's going to be all right. We'll have fun doing it. And that's all that matters, right? Right. So that'll be off in a, in a couple weeks, most likely. Uh, you know what? I could dedicate a tractor to that. Ooh. Could I? I can do that. Because I can run course play. Tell you what, guys. I think we might work on this next video. Just to throw something completely different at your face. I don't know. Let's uh, let's get to the next video and we'll 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 figure out. I'll figure out between now and then what we're gonna do because realistically, harvesting canola, I only need one of these. I mean, yeah, I might have times where I have to stop, but it's canola. It's okay. So let's uh, let's get to the next video and we'll figure out what we're gonna do. Until then, I'm your boy John from Puma Plow. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that like button for more. Subscribe if you have not already done so. I'd really appreciate that. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, 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 what's my line? Oh, yeah. Toodles.